KLM Builders. I just finished a whole condo renovation on Lake Michigan. Let me show you what we did. First came into this customer's condo in her great living space. She had some older laminate and it was yellowed badly by the front of the windows where all the sun was bleeding the poly through. So she wanted a total upgraded look. So what we did is we added this beautiful MSI vinyl planking with padding on the bottom, waterproof. And for the ceilings, they had spancrete with seams and it had a popcorn texture that the customer did not like. So she had the ceiling lowered down. We had then lowered some of the vent work and they ended up also moving the sprinkler system for easier access with the lower ceiling. And we also, in the living space, we added this beautiful crown with LED lights that reflect off the ceiling to give it a more elegant look. We trimmed the fireplace with what matches the kitchen cabinet and we also used the same tile backsplash that we used in the kitchen to accent the fireplace. Here we took out this wall that totally impeded the beautiful lakefront view that they have. So we added some additional cabinets on this side of the living space to accent the living area and give some stool top seating area for uh, a little breakfast area. And then we topped it off with the beautiful stock Q Quartz Calcutta Valentine, which really accents the maple cabinets from Countryside with a Lancaster door with a beautiful flint stain finish. And for this customer's backsplash that we also used as an accent on her fireplace, she chose a Glazio Queen's Lyre Nimbus Cloud, which has octagons with an alabaster grout. And then for the upper cabinets and the bigger boxes, this customer chose to use the same countryside cabinet, but they used a beautiful moss painted finish, which really shows the elegance. We also added a nice garage opening port for the customer for her to keep her coffee maker and that way she has countertop space and then she can just close it when she's done with the use which is a nice accent to really utilize the space that we, we had to work with. For her uppers, chose a under cabinet light rail where we added some LED lights. She also wanted us to add some LED crown lights like we did in the living room space. Space here, this wall was actually at an angle like the wall adjoining it, and they wanted to get a little more space through the opening, so we shrunk this area a little bit. It had mirrors all the way around the inside. We took all that out, added the nice cabinets, put the uppers with some rain glass through the upper doors with some inside LED lighting and also lighting for the crown. This customer had us totally renovate the hall baths, rip up the existing four foot shower, all the old wallpaper. We added a new cabinet with the Lancaster door front from Countryside with maple wood and a mist painted finish. We also added a beautiful Cambria countertop with a 90 degree Moen faucet. After shower, they had a 60 inch soaker tub with a or three foot shower stall. We took the wall out to give it a little bit more space in between the tub and shower and we converted the tub into a 60 inch shower with a beautiful 65 inch rain head with eight jets. For the wall tile in the showers, we used one of our stock of Pomesa's Lensi Blanco. We also did a tile floor with heat. We added heated floors in both bathrooms. 
We modified the sink space to have two beautiful sinks with a cabinet in between the two sinks. And we also added a nice big utility cabinet where the old shower was. This customer got their condo totally renovated to their new style and now they're ready to move in.